they trip and they slither and they slip into Claudia's caribou kitchen. And they fly and they flop and they hurry and they hop into Claudia's caribou kitchen. And they bounce and they bump and they jostle and they jump and they strut and they stride and they gallop and they glide and they roll and they rock and they flutter and they flop into Claudia's caribou kitchen. is an anteater. He is also the cook at the caribou kitchen. Oh dear. Abe is not feeling well today. What's wrong, Abe? I think I'm ill. I have a tummy ache. You've probably just eaten too many ants. I haven't eaten any ants. Well, you must be hungry then. Here, have one. No. When an anteater doesn't want to eat ants, he must be really ill. So Claudia wraps Abe up and sends him home to lie down. Then she turns the sign from closed to open. The caribou kitchen is open for lunch, but there is no cook. Claudia will have to do the cooking today. One potato, two potatoes, three potatoes, four, five potatoes, six potatoes, seven potatoes, more, eight, nine, ten, ten potatoes. Ooh. I hope I'm doing this right. The special today is spud buns. Claudia is trying to make spud buns. Oh no! and do everything else as well. Here comes Mrs. Panda. Hello? Hello! Lisa is a lemur. She is also the waitress at the caribou kitchen. Hello, Mrs. P. Sorry to keep you waiting. Ooh, well, there's no cause to rush about like that. Mrs. Panda is a panda. There is only one thing which a panda likes to eat. Bamboo, if you please. Oh, Mrs. P, you always have that. And you always say that. S-p-a-d-b-a-n-s. <laughs> the special today is spud buns. Well, I would like some bamboo. Yes, Mrs. P. Well, write it down then. One bamboo. Claudia is finding out that cooking can be hard work. Make the special, check the grill, stir the stew. Ooh, how does Abe manage? There's too many things to do. One bamboo. Can you come in and get it yourself, please, Lisa? I'm rushed off my feet. No problem. Um, what does it look like? It's straight and long. Uh, coming right up. Caroline is a cow. Godfrey is a goat. Goats eat almost anything. I say, lovely pattern. Tom is a tortoise. He's also the waiter at the caribou kitchen. Please don't nibble the tablecloth, Godfrey. Oh, I do apologise. What will you have, Caroline, my dear? Spud buns. Spud buns. Oh, moo. <laughs> that sounds splendid. Make that two spud buns. Two spud buns. Meanwhile, Lisa is surprising Mrs. Panda. This isn't bamboo, this is rhubarb. Are you sure? I'm a panda. I know bamboo. It's straight and long like bamboo. But bamboo is not red, it's yellow. Oops, sorry. Yellow, not red. Yellow, not red. Claudia is just taking the spud buns out of the oven. Yellow, not red. Yellow, not red. Um, 
Is this yellow? Yes. One bamboo coming right up. Oh, but, yeah, but that's it. Oh, by the way, Tom just took an order for two spud buns. Two spud buns. One. Two. Claudia's spud buns are incredibly crumbly. Mmm. But they taste all right. Two spud buns. Wow, that was quick. I didn't even have time to say it. Lisa is still finding Mrs. Panda hard to please. It's straight, and it's long, and it's yellow. But it is not bamboo. It's spaghetti that hasn't been cooked. No. Oh, oh, silly me. Bamboo has little green leaves on it, you see. Little green leaves. Little green leaves. Uh, coming right up. That is celery. But it's got little green leaves. Is there some problem in the kitchen today? Oh, yes. It's terrible, Mrs. P. Abe is ill, and Claudia has to do all the cooking on her own. Well, why didn't you say so? I'd be more than happy to help you out. Oh, thank you, Mrs. P. Poor, slow Tom. He's only just brought the spud buns. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. That's not fair. He has more than me. You each have the same. They're just crumbly. Pardon me, <laughs> but why don't you just do this? There you are. One, two, three, four, five. Now you have more pieces. But that's not fair either. Well then. Oh dear. Now you both have a lot of pieces, don't you? <laughs> Some customers are terribly difficult. Meanwhile in the kitchen, Claudia is just beginning to get everything under control. Um, Mrs. P has offered to help out. Oh, that's very kind, but the spud buns are all ready, the stew is simmering, and the nut grill is... I wouldn't bother with all of that. No, no. Just give everyone bamboo. It's the only thing you have here worth eating. Oh, dear. When some people help out, it's no help at all. I think Claudia will be very glad when Abe is well again, don't you? Mm -hmm.